Hi, Roy. My name's Mary. I'm the owner of the blue van you left a note on. Um, I was just going to find out what happened, and I did notice some damage on my van. Please get a hold of me, and we'll figure something out. Thanks. Hello? Hello, Mary? No, it's Roy. What? You're not Roy. It's Roy. What are you talking no, about? No, you are. I know. I said, are you Mary? Yes. Oh, okay. Well, that was weird. Ashley, back off. Ashley asked me who it was. What? My daughter. My daughter asked me who I was talking to. Oh, man. Tell her to be quiet. Yeah, I left a note on your car. Quiet. <laughs> you said be quiet. Yeah, I got that note. How old is she? What happened? How old's your daughter? She's 11. Oh, okay. Well, never mind then. I guess that would be inappropriate for me to ask that. Okay. Yeah, I was underneath your car. I was <laughs> fixing something. And... um. Uh, you're not going to believe this. It's so st- I feel so stupid, but my car rolled into your van. Like I left the parking brake off, and when I was while I was underneath your car, and and my car rolled into your van. I seen that. Okay, and I'm sorry. Okay. Um, was I looked at it yesterday? Yeah, yesterday morning. Yeah, and I'm sorry I took there so long to get back to you because I, I I was in jail. Oh, that's crappy. Yeah. Yeah. Typical weekend, you know. I am I'm sorry. You, sorry. you said you looked you at it. Stay out of trouble. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know. There is a scratch on my van and a little dent on it. Like by the headlight. That's where no. I hit it. It's on the headlight. The headlight. Are you talking about the driver's side or the passenger side? More like the driver's side. But like my car no. bumped into it. I wasn't even in my car when it happened. I was underneath your van. Oh. And and my. You car- were underneath my van. Yeah, I was working on something. And and my. I, I left the parking brake off, and it rolled into it, and, and then it made your van roll forward, and I think it might have hit something in, in front also, like your van bumped into something. I don't know. So it might have got both the front and the back. I don't know. I All I know is I didn't see any damage except for the side, but I don't think it hit the side. Oh, no. It was more just like the very back, and yeah, yeah. My, my car, I left it in gear and, and turned on. So it just started driving itself forward. So really, I don't even know if I'm responsible technically, because I wasn't driving and the car. And you said that you were under where? I was underneath your van, working on something. Why was you underneath my van? I was working on something. You were working on something underneath my van? Yeah. What were you it, working on under my van? I don't really want to say, if you don't mind. I'll just, I'd rather... I really need you to say what you were doing under my van. I was fixing something. What were you fixing? Okay, I, I'm kind of a graffiti artist, and my thing, mm-hmm. I like to be original. My thing is I like to get underneath the van and draw things with spray paint and Sharpies and sometimes even crayons. Mm-hmm. And I was drawing a picture of Dick Butt. Under my van? Yeah, on the bottom, like kind of where the, the along the, the tailpipe muffler thing, you know, the pipe. <clears throat> Why and, would you draw on somebody else's van? But it, it's underneath. It's not like anyone can see it. But the point is, I'm an but artist, still. and I know it's there. And it just makes me happy to know that like, I'm driving around, and every car in the neighborhood has my art underneath it. Well, I think that's destroying other people's property, don't you think? Well, you wouldn't even know about it if I hadn't said anything. You, you should get under and admire it. And like the thing is, like someday, if you're getting an oil change or you're getting work done, the mechanical lift it up, and he'll look under there, and he'll just be like, Wow. I'll look, this looks I'll look at really it. neat. Did you put your initials on there anyway? Yeah, I did actually on on right in, on the bottom part of the art. All right. Well, thanks for telling me. I didn't see any damage on it. I thought but you said please don't write on my van no more. I wouldn't. I would never write on the van itself. I was writing on the bottom. Right. No, you said that you didn't hit the side of the van, just the back. Yeah, and. It hit it pretty hard, though. There wasn't, like, any cracks or any. I thought I saw a crack. There is a crack in my bumper. Oh, no. But I wasn't driving That's the car. I wanted to talk to you before I made a police report, which I didn't really see any significant damage, and I didn't make a police report. You did? I was kind of wanting to talk to you first. Oh, yeah. I'm glad you didn't. Because the van's not in my name. Whose name is it? The van is in my daughter's dad's name, and oh. he wanted to come up here and find you. Well, it's not even your property, but then. You can't You can't tell me not to paint on it, not to spray paint it. And I'm driving it. It's in my possession. But I'm saying I don't think it's really my fault that I cracked the bumper because I wasn't in my car at the time. I was underneath the van, mm-hmm. 
and and like I'm lucky right. to be alive. Well, thanks your, for calling me. Your van. Don't ride on my van no more. Well, it's not even your van. It's your dad's daughter's whatever. It doesn't matter, dude. I know, you but don't go around writing on people's cars. I, it's not that I just scribbled nonsense on it. It's art. I have nothing more to say. Like you know, someday I'm going to be a famous <laughs> artist, and she's gone. Hello. Hey, Mary. Um, wh- the reason I was really calling those, I I really think, I, I think that I'm gonna sue you for attempted manslaughter because your van almost rolled over me <laughs> when my car. You shouldn't have been under my van. It doesn't matter. The fact is that, that I was there. Go ahead, sue me, asshole. What? Don't call me an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>